Hello everyone. Welcome to our WordPress tutorial. Today, we'll show you how to create a custom menu, complete with dropdowns and submenus, to enhance your website's navigation. Let's get started. In our last video, we successfully built an engaging LMS homepage, and if you haven't checked it out yet, you can find the link in the description below. Today, we're diving into an essential aspect of your site's navigation, creating and editing menus. To get started, go ahead and click on the Customize option. This will take you to the WordPress Customizer, where you can make various changes to your site's appearance and functionality. Once you're in the Customizer, scroll down until you find the Menu section. As you can see, I currently have a main menu active on my site. However, I want to start fresh and create a new menu from scratch. So, let's go ahead and delete the existing one. To do this, Simply scroll down until you see the option to delete menu. Click on the Create a New Menu. Enter a name for your menu, such as Main Menu, to clearly identify its purpose. Scroll down and check the box for Primary Menu. This ensures your menu will appear prominently in the header or navigation area of your site. After selecting the location, click the Next button to proceed and start adding items to your menu. To add items to your menu, Navigate to the section where your pages are listed. Simply check the box next to the pages you want to include. Once you select a page, click the Add to Menu button, and you'll see the selected pages added to your menu immediately. If you want to add a new page that doesn't already exist, type the desired page name into the provided field. After entering the name, click the Add to Menu button to create and include it in your menu. You can repeat this process to add as many pages as necessary to meet your website's needs. To create a drop-down menu, submenu, simply drag the page item slightly under the main menu item. This will establish a hierarchy and make navigation more user-friendly. Repeat this process for all pages you want to include in the drop-down. Before finalizing your menu, Take some time to research and determine which menu items are necessary to effectively showcase your website's elements and provide a clear navigation experience for your visitors. Once you've added all the necessary items and organized your menu to your satisfaction, make sure to click Publish and save your changes. You can always return to the menu section to edit items, rearrange them, or remove any that are no longer needed. This flexibility allows you to continually refine your menu as your website evolves. To change the color and background of your menu, navigate back to the Customize section of your WordPress dashboard. Look for the Header Builder option in the Customizer menu. Click on the option for Transparent Header to modify the header's appearance as desired. From there, navigate to the Design. In the Design settings, you have the flexibility to customize various elements of your header section to enhance the overall look and feel of your website. You can start by adjusting the background overlay to create a visually appealing backdrop for your header. Choose colors or opacity levels that align with your site's aesthetic. Additionally, you can change the menu color to ensure that your main menu items stand out and complement your branding, helping to create a cohesive visual experience. For submenu items, drop downs, you can customize the submenu color to differentiate them from the main menu, which improves clarity and user navigation. Furthermore, there are options to modify other header elements, such as fonts, spacing, and additional styling options, allowing you to explore all available settings to achieve your desired header appearance. By utilizing these design customization options, you can create a unique and visually appealing header that enhances your website's overall user experience. If you have any questions or need assistance with specific changes, feel free to ask. Thank you for watching. We hope this tutorial helped you create and customize your WordPress menu. Remember to explore the design options to make your header truly unique. If you have any questions, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more WordPress tips. Happy building!